Hey, how's it going? This is Melinda and welcome to my channel. And today is part two of showing you my record collection. So I'm going to be showing more progressive rock, classic rock, bands that I have some records of, but not a huge collection of, but I do also have a lot of Cheap Trick, Fleetwood Mac, a lot of cool records to show you in this video. So please stay tuned and I hope you enjoy. Here is part two of my record collection. Okay, so let's go ahead and get started. My husband is videotaping this and I told him if he saw something and wanted to make a comment to feel free. Uh, this is one I just like leaving in the front because of the gold foil. It's the Monterey Pop Festival. It was a record store day record and away we go. This is a great new release that I, well, was just given to me, a great record. Seven Horse, love that one. 13th Floor Elevators. We go into 38 Special. Here's my ACBC collection. ABBA, Paula Abdul. Aerosmith, I have several Aerosmith records. Air Supply. <laughs> Here's the Almond Brothers. Everybody has to have whipped cream and other delights. Asia, love Asia. Rick Astley, Badfinger. <laughs> Bad Company. Oh, I just got one out of place there. Here's Marty Ballin, love him. Bangles, Beach Boys. And this is a first pressing of Pet Sounds. I really love having a first press. It's a mono pressing, really, really cool. And we move on, the last is the Beastie Boys. And then we move on to the next shell. Starts with Beck, Jeff Beck, Bee Gees. Love Bee Gees, Belle Biv DeVoe. Big star, Clint Black. That's an awesome record there. Black Flag, Black Sabbath. Got a few of these Master of Reality records. Love Blondie. I love Blue Oyster Cult. What an underrated band. Colin Bluestone. Sonny Bono, that is a really cool psychedelic record, you guys. Uh, Booker T and the MGs. Uh, and yes, a couple Michael Boltons, I'm not gonna lie, I like him on occasion. Boston. Third stage. Here's my David Bowie records. A lot of great music. Laura Branigan, who wouldn't want that? The best of bread, oh my goodness. Garth Brooks, thank you Billy Hurst. That was a tremendous record that he gifted me. Here are two Buckingham Knicks copies. This one is just still in shrink and a promotional copy. This is a promotional copy of Blue Cheer, Jeff Buckley. This is my one and only Budgie record. I'm hoping to change that. Kate Bush, Greatest Hits. Here's some birds. Call. Here's Can. Trout Master Replica, my <laughs> husband's favorite record. <laughs> the Cars, The Cars Greatest Hits. Uh, okay, so those are my little records from when I was a kid uh, that I loved. Sean Cassidy, Chad and Jeremy. Uh, this is still in shrink, Tracy Chapman. Found that at a flea market for so cheap so many years ago. So glad I picked that up. This is autographed. Thank you, Mike from Nebraska, for getting the autographs of Cheap Trick. I have quite a bit of Cheap Trick, and that brings me to the next row of records. We continue on with Cheap Trick. Cher. Love Cher and Chic. This is a greatest hits. That's really a cool listen. Chicago. Chipmunks. Who doesn't want the chipmunks? Cinderella with the record bar hype. Love that one. Eric Clapton. 
The Clash. This is a very cool record my husband absolutely hates. <laughs> Clear Light. Some Phil Collins. Alice Cooper. Elvis Costello, The Cranberries. Clear, and I have a lot of CCR here. Okay, Culture Club ends that particular bin, and we will move on. This bin, we'll start out with the damn Yankees. Charlie Daniels, this is an autograph. Charlie Daniels autograph record. Betty Davis, Matt King Cole, Roger Daltrey's Tommy, Taylor Dane. This is a 12 inch single of Dead or Lives You Spin Me Round. Here is Hail Satin by the Dee Gees. Delight, a 12 inch single of uh, Grooves in the Heart. Deep Purple, Def Leppard, High and Dry. Here's the original of Hysteria and a reissue of Hysteria on two LPs. Pyromania. Pyromania. Pesh Mode. Dio, Dire Straits. Here's my Doors records that are not the analog productions, but just some of the others that I have in the collection. Duran Duran. This is a great one. This is a gift. Some Eagles. Sheena Easton. Electric Prunes. Extreme. Little Fagan Farm. And First Boy on the Moon. Roberta Flack. Fleetwood Mac's Greatest Hits, 12-inch single of Big Love. Here is a 45 RPM Fleetwood Mac record. Sounds absolutely wonderful. The alternate Fleetwood Mac, the alternate Live, a regular copy of Live, Mirage, and the alternate Mirage. These were the alternate ones for, were from Record Store Day. This is a 45 RPM Fleetwood Mac. This sounds absolutely incredible as well. And the alternate Fleetwood Mac. Again, those were sold for Record Store Day. This is a Live Rumors LP. Brings me into Tango in the Night and the alternate Tango in the Night, a Record Store Day exclusive. Here is an alternate take of Tusk. Record Store Day record, Tusk. Fleet, uh, Flock of Seagulls. These are my Flying Burrito Brothers Intervention records. John Fogarty. Samantha Fox, I actually really loved her. Frampton Comes Alive, I think everyone has that one in their collection. Invisible Touch, a great record from Genesis. Bobby Gentry. Georgia Satellites. This is still sealed of Electric Youth my golden earring. A couple of people had asked me if I had any golden earrings. I do have a couple. Gladys Knight. Selena Gomez. Amy Grant. Grateful Dead. The Grief soundtrack. I have three Great White albums. Love Great White. Oh, I have four actually. Uh, Al Green. This is an incredible record. Let's stay together. So fantastic. Green Day, Guns N' Roses, Their Greatest Hits, Lies. Great Gypsy record, All in Oats. George Harrison, All Things Must Pass. Continuing on with George Harrison. The Hassle, that's a Billy Joel album. Corey Hart, Hawkwind, love having that one.
Hootie and the Blowfish. This one is Fairweather Johnson. That one's a hard one to get. Bruce Hornsby. Whitney. Oh, looky there, Billy Hurst. <laughs> Love having him in the collection. In excess. Billy Idol. I love having the original and the reissue. This is a great one. Chris Isaac. Jade Warrior on the Vertigo label. Jade Warrior. Betty James. This one is out of place. The Killers. I just didn't want it to get messed up. So we move on to Elton John. I have quite a bit of Elton John in my collection. Little Jonas Brothers, my daughter's favorite band growing up. So it's sentimental, Tom Jones, she's a lady. Journey, a beautiful collection of Journey records. That's a terrible looking album cover. Kajagoogoo. Kesha. <laughs> the Killers. Here's the rest of my Killers records. Albert King. That's a killer sounding one. Speaker's Corner. This is a great record. King Crimson. The Kinks. For Nap, Lady Gaga, and Cindy Lauper. All right, moving on with the L's, we've got John Lennon's Double Fantasy. This is a great sounding record. Julian Lennon, Liberace. Now, I have that one because that's the one and only record that my dad brought to me uh, before he passed away. Gordon Lightfoot. I love Gordon Lightfoot. Little River Band. I, I love them too. Love. Great. MC5. Mammoth. My husband's favorite artist of all time, Barry Manilow. Yeah. Nope. <laughs> Dean Martin. George Martin. Mask soundtrack. I have my soundtracks in another spot. I'm going to have to go back over and pull. Moving on with Curtis Mayfield, Superfly. This is an original Reba. That's a very cool find. Meatloaf. I have quite a few John Mellicamp records. I'm from Indiana, so what's a girl to do? Love him. Whenever he wanted. Here's my Metallica collection. These were the Walmart exclusives. The Meters, George Michael. Love that one. The Minutemen, Joni Mitchell. The Moody Blues. Someone was asking me if I had any Moody Blues. I do. Motley Crue. Mr. Mister. Motha Hoople. Nelson. Everybody wants Nelson in their collection. Willie Nelson. This is a very hard to find Willie Nelson record. This one too. Shotgun Willie. Stevie Nicks. We're going to see her in concert soon. I'm very excited about that. And I love her so much. Night Ranger to Harry Nelson. There's my Dombrana. Another soundtrack that needs to be moved into my soundtracks. Parliament. That was from Steve Carlson. Grievous Angel. Moose Dolly. Mm 
the Proclaimers. I put this one in here because I didn't want the zipper. I leave it out front so that the zipper doesn't mess with my other records. So that's just a little bit of an oddball one. Um, then we get into Procol Harum. A few little Queen records here. Queen Drake. Quiet Riot, with one with the hype sticker, the original. Original REM records. Here is a Half Speed Masters uh, REO Speedwagon. What a great record. And of course, I had to keep the one with the hype sticker. RTZ, that is a Brad Delp record that's really cool. Eddie Rabbit. Ram Jam, this is Black Betty, the 12 inch single. It sounds incredible. Ramones. Rat. Sometimes I want to hear a little jazz, and sometimes I just want to hear a little rat. Here's Red Hot Chili Peppers. Otis Redding. Lou Reed. The speaker's corner of Lou Reed Transformers is everything that everybody says it is. It's fantastic. Sounds great. Righteous Brothers. Rihanna. Roxy Music, this sounds fantastic. Rush, here's a few of my Rush records that I really love. And it ends with Rush Signals up here at the end. I have the box set, so I just keep the records out to keep them handy so I can grab them quite easily. Love Sade, Santana. And go into Supernatural. I love some Boss Gags, Silsa Croft. Scorpions are awesome. The Seeds, Bob Seeker. Shocking Blue. Someone asked me if I had some Shocking Blue. A little bit of Frank Sinatra. Love Frank. Skid Row. Autograph Slaughter Test Pressings. This is the elemental music version of Sunny and Cher. I love that one. Sound Garden, Britney Spears. This is a, a white label promo of The River. Billy Squire. So hard. Steppenwolf, Cat Stevens. This is an original. This is an original. I have an extra because I just absolutely love that record, so I bought two. I have a pretty good sized sticks collection. I bought this just because it had the poster. I love having posters. This is a 45 RPM of hot stuff. Love the band Sweet. Here's my Taylor Swift collection. Where's the bow? Talk Talk. This is a, an autographed copy of Toad the Wet Sprocket. Collection. Train, Triumph, and Jethro Tull. And it finishes up with the turtles. Here we are with my U2 collection. 
Going to be seeing them in concert soon. Looking forward to going to the Sphere. Carrie Underwood. Here's Van Morrison. Someone asked me about my Van Morrison collection. It was short but sweet. <laughs> Velvet Fog. The Velvet Underground. The Wallflowers. This is signed by Chad Kasson, but it's a Joe Walsh record. Very cool. It was an Analog Productions. Here's Joe Walsh, Analog Man. Com a comedy record. Wang Chung. This is an. This is the Friday Music version, and this is an original of Warren's Cherry Pie. I have a couple of copies of originals of Warren's Dirty, Rotten, Filthy, Stinking, Rich. Here is Dionne Warwick. Muddy Waters, The Weeknd. Bob Welch, I love this album. I'm Your Man, 12-inch single, Make It Big. Jody Watley. Another soundtrack when Harry met Sally and Wilson and White Snake. And here is Keith Whitley, Don't Close Your Eyes. That's a little bit of a hard, this is an original. And then here is my Who collection. Here's my two winger records that I have. Love those. Here's Stevie Wonder. Someone was asking about it. Again, a short but sweet collection. Uh, the Wrecking Crew, Dreamweaver, Tammy Wynette, Winona. I have quite a few Yes albums. This is an original Harvest and ZZ Top. These 45 RPM 12 inch singles sound absolutely wonderful. And these are Zimbo Trio. This is in a, a Brazilian record. Okay, so we're gonna finish up now. These are some of my soundtracks. Obviously, as you saw in the collection, I need to move some soundtracks over to this section. Uh, again, another Garth Brooks box set, a Motown box set. Here are some of my classical records. I don't have a huge collection, but I do have a start of a classical collection. And then here are my Mobile Fidelity One Steps, just down here at the bottom. I just like keeping them handy and out of the boxes so that when I'm in the mood to listen to them, I can just go grab them. And then also here at the end of this video, these are compilation, compilation records. You could think k -Tel and all of those wonderful records that we had as kids. And that concludes part two of my record collection. And if you have any questions about anything you saw in the video, please feel free to ask in the comments. If you enjoyed this video, please subscribe, hit the like button and the notification bell. Thank you so much for watching and I'll see you next time. Take care, bye-bye.